today I'm gonna be talking about my favorite women's fragrances. These are my top fragrances that I think would be such a good fit for any occasion. So I'm breaking it down as far as like what kind of times I use these fragrances for, but these are my favorite fragrances I have ever smelled in my entire life. So <laughs> I am gonna be sharing with you today my personal perfume collection. These are the scents that get me through life right now. These are scents that are so majestic and beautiful and I'm gonna show you how I wear them, when I wear them. If you are a returning lovey, thank you so much for coming back and checking out my new video. I'm so, so grateful for you guys. I know this past couple of months I've been taking some time off, but I have been seeing new subscribers come in. So I just really want to thank you and welcome you to the tribe. If you are someone new and you don't know me and this is your first time watching, hello. Welcome to my channel. I hope that you're having a wonderful and beautiful day. My hope is to inspire you to live your everyday life with meaning, purpose, Purpose, knowing that you are of purpose and that you are enough today just as you are but this channel has everything to do with all things girly I mean I love 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 fashion style beauty I am a mother of two little girls and a wife to a beautiful husband and it just means a lot to me to be able to share the ups and the downs of life with you so if this is something that you think would be a great fit for you I would love for you to consider subscribing to the channel you would be a great addition to our tribe our growing tribe we're at 610 subscribers you guys that's so exciting thank you so much I love scents I have loved perfume ever since I was a little girl I remember going into shops with my mom we couldn't afford to buy the perfume at that time but we would just go to Macy's and we would walk around and we would ask if they had little samples and back then the samples were so cute I mean they weren't just in this little like you know they had the actual bottle and actually i just got a sample from nordstrom the other day and it reminded me of the times my mother and i would go and get these little samples because back then all of the perfumes that you were hoping to buy came the little samples came in a little miniature bottle and i think that is so so incredibly chic and beautiful and i i mean if i love the bottle in big i'm gonna love it a hundred thousand bazillion times more when it's in its little form i don't know why i like little things it just makes me so happy it literally like brings me so much joy to see um a little perfume size this this size um what i also love about getting samples like this is that you can take them in your bag or you can take them traveling with you anyway all this to say i am a huge huge lover of scent and perfumes they um, they create a great ambiance for yourself they create just a mood you know and a vibe so with all this to say um, here are my top favorite perfumes my first one right now this is what I would call a signature scent I believe everybody should have a signature scent and this is one that really really would go well with so many different personalities. This is the Chloe Eau de Parfum. This is in the 2.5 fluid ounces. It is actually it comes with the top, but I took it off because I really like the I really like how it looks without the top on. I love the bottle. Uh, the bottle to me is just so chic and beautiful. I love seeing it on my little stand that I have all my perfumes in. I really really love the little um, the tie that it comes with um, but what I love most about it obviously is the scent the top notes on this are peony lychee and freesia the heart of the fragrance has rose magnolia and lily let me show you a lily I don't know if this is the actual color that they use but this is a lily I love lilies they start off not very cute they look my husband says like a butthole <laughs> <laughs> and then they open up to this amazing beautiful flower but anyway i digress okay i'm gonna spray it oh my gosh you guys if i can describe the scent of chloe it just it smells like a classic beautiful chic secure woman that is what it that is what it that's what it smells like to me it has this florally beautiful scent that right off the bat you just feel fresh 
it like that's what it feels like it feels like you spray it and you just feel this freshness to it and i think it's because of all the beautiful flowers and top notes that it has the peony and the freesia but at the base of the fragrance it has warm amber and cedar wood when you spray it the first thing that comes to mind is the florals right but then after it lingers a little bit it starts turning into this warm scent which is why i believe it's a great signature scent for somebody because it has both like a juxtaposition of floral and kind of woodsy and it kind of, and it anchors the fragrance together i really like that because that's how i feel like a woman you know sometimes i'm i'm really weak and frail and i'm really um i feel vulnerable um and other times i feel really strong and i feel like i can conquer anything through christ um, but i love that this fragrance it kind of embodies that for me this one i actually end up using when i have like a really chic and beautiful outfit this is my go-to scent when i feel really classic and chic so and it's an everyday type of perfume i think i would use it every single day the next perfume that I think is an amazing perfume for like a weekend, and obviously the, the name of it is so cute. It's called Lazy Sunday Morning. It's by Replica. The bottle, you guys, is amazing. I love, love that you don't have to, you know, open it up. It has no fuss, no muss. You just spray it on. It is a beautiful, beautiful bottle. I absolutely adore it. It's the thing that I love about it is the intensity of the scent. It smells like I am waking up on Sunday morning laying in my sheets. It's like that freshness of, of, of really great sheets. I really like this scent for the weekend and for some reason I only use it <laughs> um, when I am out and about and just like running errands. I don't really like to use that one as an everyday scent because it is a little more pungent. It has a little more of a kick. And all of these are Eau de Parfum, so they're not gonna be lasting for a very long time. You're gonna spray them, they're gonna last a while, and then you'll have to reapply because that's what happens to Eau de Parfum. Um, it doesn't last an entire day. The next perfume I'm gonna talk about is the Marc Jacobs Decadence. This perfume is my date night perfume, or kind of like, you know, things need to get spicy. <laughs> <laughs> and you know you know what god made sex and he made it in the covenant of a of a married couple and i think i love now to be able to talk about that boldly because i don't want anybody to feel ashamed of sex because god made it and he made it so that we would enjoy it in the covenant of, of relationship um and i really appreciate that God has redeemed that part of my life in a way that has been so beautiful. And I now get to enjoy that with my husband. But this fragrance, you guys, it is so, so decadent. I, oh my gosh, <laughs> the name of the fragrance is Decadence. I think that was already in my mind, but it really, I think they named it beautifully because it is definitely not something you wear every day. Well, it wouldn't be for me. It, it has this really strong, strong woman like, yes, I am here. I am here on a date. <laughs> and I would probably not wear this if I was going to. Like the other day we went to just like a movie and dinner and I was wearing something very casual. And I didn't find myself reaching for it because it wasn't the type of date like outfit that I think would have gone with the fragrance. But... If you are on a hot date and you're going out or a wedding or something like that, something like a special event, a red carpet event, this would be an amazing, amazing fragrance for you. I'm going to share with you what the notes of this are. So for the Marc Jacobs, we have Italian plum, iris, saffron as the top notes. It's very spicy. That's what I, that's the thing that I, that I smell from it, but not in like a, ooh, get away from me type of way. It's just so, it, it, it just, it's decadent. It smells decadent. And I think it's the saffron in there. It really does um, spice up your nose when you first smell it. The heart of the fragrance has Bulgarian rose, jasmine, sandback. I don't even know what that is. And orris. I don't even know what that is either. I think those might be spices. I don't know. And the base is liquid amber, velvety, vetiver. Vetiver, vetiver, and papyrus woods. So obviously all of these 
notes on this fragrance make it such a decadent and beautiful and and grounding perfume for your date night or special occasion and the bottle i mean you guys it looks like a cute little handbag and i love 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 seeing this on my little vanity for my fragrances i think it's an amazing bottle this would be an amazing gift for Christmas. I think it's so beautiful. The next one is one that I think is just such another possibility for a signature scent. This is Diptyque and it's Eau de, Ro de Rose. I'm trying to be French and be Frenchy. Eau de Rose. Eau Rose. I don't know if it's Rose, Rose, or we'll just call it Eau Rose. <laughs> <laughs> so you can figure out how to find it. I'm just kidding. There will be links on the blog post of today just so you can uh, easily shop all of these fragrances if you are interested in shopping them. I'm going to put them all on a blog post for you. I'll link that down below so that you don't have any qualms about trying to find these, um, find where to shop them. Um, but yeah, this is from Diptyque. I love Diptyque. They have amazing fragrances. I love their candles. They are very pricey and bougie. Um, but I feel like this is one of those fragrances that it's kind of comparable to a Chanel fragrance or a Jo Malone fragrance. It's very clean, very classic, very chic. It's going to go with most personalities. It really is something like a, it, it, it's, it is a floral. Obviously it's Eau de Rose, so it has a lot of floral notes it's just one of my favorite 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 fragrances i used to have a little travel size of it i gave it away because somebody was complimenting me on it because i do get a lot of compliments when i wear this fragrance i think it's because it's just very soothing it's very it's not like you know it's not trying to be like date night here um it's just very soothing and comforting and, and it's very floral and light so if you like that kind of fragrance, floral light, and you like the smell of roses, and you love uh, the packaging, this is an amazing, amazing buy. And again, this would be a great fit for an everyday type of perfume. Or I think this is also a really nice um, touch for a date night when it's not like, I guess if I were to go on a date and it wasn't super fancy, I would go with this one because it just has that really nice floral fresh clean vibe that's it my beloved friend those are all of my personal favorite perfumes this is my perfume collection i hope that you enjoyed this video and that you consider giving me a thumbs up it really does encourage me to continue to produce awesome content for you guys and i would love for you to comment down below let me know what your signature scent is and let me know if you remember what your what your first experience with perfume was did you have a perfume did your mom wear a perfume like what was your introduction to perfumery <laughs> i would love to hear from you on a comment down below and i will be back next week i'm gonna do a fall series so here we go we're gonna start fall in the right direction the right foot i'm really excited for it fall starts september 23rd but on my channel the fall series is coming next wednesday so stay tuned for that i love you guys have a beautiful week. Adios. Ooh, I smell all kinds of ways right now. This is gonna be crazy. The next perfume that I, oh my gosh, this is so long already. <laughs>